Hey everyone, it's Walkthrough Wednesday again. Today I'm going to show you uh, a unit we just got in from Indiana yesterday, the 2870 Rear Living Passport. So uh, the Rear Living layout is an incre incredibly popular floor plan. So I'm glad that Passport makes one of those now. So uh, a lot like a typical Rear Living, you get the nice big center island. Um, so the sink is still facing everyone else. These really pretty pendants. Um, trifold sofa sleeper in the back so oftentimes in these lighter weight trailers uh, you're gonna get like a jackknife sofa um, but this one is a true trifold so it's gonna pull out comfortably sleep two people um, your recliners directly across from the TV and fireplace uh, I really love the the updated modern decor that, that Passport has done the, the darker backsplash and the lighter colors that contrast well with it um, Nice big pantry that you would get in a, a bigger travel trailer. I mean, it's all the amenities that you'd get in a bigger one, um, but it's smaller and it's half ton total, so it's a win-win. A uh, little coffee bar over here, abundance of drawers, some additional storage, and this one has the GE um, residential refrigerator. And, oh, good. See, I told you it hasn't been through. It just got here yesterday. It hasn't been through the shop yet. Luckily, this is just purely cosmetics, covering the uh, screws up here, so that's not an eyesore. Their little 3M tape didn't didn't work very well. There, see? All better. Luckily, it doesn't mess with the function of the fridge. It's just aesthetics. <laughs> uh, coming through here, you have direct bathroom access right when you walk in the camper. So that's always nice if kiddos are dirty or pets or anything, or you just have to go to the bathroom. You don't have to traipse through the coach. Coming back here, um, which I don't know if I can get over there, but usually in these littler trailers, you just get um, the wardrobe on each side of the bed. With this one, they actually added another nook in here that you get a rod um, for more clothes in here. So sometimes customers complain, you know, this just isn't enough, or my clothes touch the bottom, my husband's super tall, so won't have that issue because you've got lots of wardrobe in here. And we'll head back out to the main area so I can get you a price on this. Okay, so $37,999, um, about three oh one a month with 10% down. And I was talking this whole time about how light this trailer is. I should probably tell you. And then we'll close with that. So dry weight on this one is only uh, 7,000 pounds. So very doable for a lot of those half ton vehicles. Um, give us a call or stop in to check it out. <laughs> 